a predicate is where I need to check the condition. So give something, I need to return true and false. But how can I use on the efficient way on Java? Where can I apply? And where should I use or not use? How can I decorate this predicate interface? Join me on this video where I'm gonna to explain to you how to make it possible. Hey, welcome to my YouTube channel, the channel for you who wants to become a better software engineer. If you want to know more about software practice, architecture, and become the ultimate sophisticated software engineer, you come to the right place. Please subscribe. Okay, let's talk about predicate. My first step here is to create a test class. So predicate test as I mentioned the idea of predicate is give one class one instance I need to check that instance and it should return a boolean value therefore true or false so should use predicate let's use here for example with numbers so I will create a predicate of numbers here with integer uh, on this case I need to check if this value is higher than 10 higher than where I will check if e is bigger than 10 I will use my favorite test tool that is a start a. So I come here, I set that higher than 10, and then I will test that condition. So the first one I will put 10 with 12, and then with 5. Oh, sorry, we five. Let's see running. I don't put equals be higher in equals, so but well, you know something goes wrong. So oh yes, it should be false here. Let's run again. The idea here is to explore the capability of conditions. If you are familiar with string, you might use that a lot when you do filter. So basically it you test the information to remove. Okay? Another good point of predicate it is that you can combine exactly like we did with function and you can also use with supplier and so on. So should decorate or compose rate predicate where as you can see I will use my power of copy and paste and right now I can use higher than 10 and then lesser than 100 lesser than 1 so I will come here so right now I'm doing the between condition and how can I combine those predicates of course if the value is a boolean I have the option to use higher than with and or or negate so Let's use R here, 100, and then test, a session, assess that, let's test with 35, and then let's test with 200.
and you can use this not only for S3 API, you can put your logic here. So let's see what's going on here. Oh, it's an or, it should be and. True, it's untrue. So let's run again. And both passed. Here, as you can see, I explored the power of predicate. It's simple, easy, and you can use more to put your condition there. That's all for today. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please let me know, put your comments, your thoughts, and see you in the next video. Bye.